Today we're at a local Mexican food spot in Ottawa called Banditos. It's mainly a taco restaurant, but some other popular menu items here include nachos, street corn, and a fair selection of drinks. It's rare to find restaurants in Ottawa that are open late, so we were happy to see that Bandito stays open till 1 a.m. Even if we aren't planning to stay that late, it's still nice to know that we can have a late dinner and not feel rushed. They have an amazing outdoor dining area, and the weather was nice, so we decided to sit outside. It looks like they converted their entire parking lot to make this huge patio. Uh, we thought that was a great idea because Ottawa people do love to eat on patios during the warm summer months. For drinks, we ordered a margarita and a vodka seltzer. The lime margarita was a bit lacking in flavor. Uh, the the Land Shark Pineapple Mango Seltzer was refreshing, but also on the weaker side. This one is probably meant to be that way since it's advertised as a lower calorie drink. Since our patio seating was right on Bank Street, we were able to catch a group passing by on a party bike. This human-powered bike can hold between 8 and 15 people and is available for rent through a local Ottawa company called The Thirsty Peddler. It's a cool way to bar hop between local pubs with a large group of friends. We started our meal with the Mexican street corn because it's one of our favorite foods that we get whenever we're in Texas. It came with two cobs covered in their house spicy butter, lime crema, cilantro, and tahine spice. And if you aren't familiar with it, tahine is a really popular spice mix that has natural chili peppers, lime, and sea salt in it. It's uh, commonly used in Mexican drinks and dishes. They actually use the lime to oh, to prop actually, it up. Yeah, to brace it so it doesn't roll <laughs> around. That's funny. Yeah. Okay, honey. Try it out. Mm-hmm. It's really creamy. Is it sour cream? I think so. It's like lime zesty. Yeah, it's super zesty. These are Bandito's famous nachos with brisket. Uh, we were pretty happy with this. The chips were still crispy and it was quite sizable. Uh, this is definitely great for sharing. Next, our three tacos arrived. First of all, the tacos here are pretty unique. Uh, you could call them a fusion of popular Mexican and Canadian flavors. We got the fish taco, the Nashville chicken taco, and the street pork taco. We also ordered a wheat beer from a local craft brewery in Ontario named Thousand Islands. This name is from the archipelago called Thousand Islands that straddles the border between the United States and Canada. This wheat beer was definitely the best drink of the night. We also really loved the nachos and the fish taco. The house hot sauce was a surprisingly good combination of flavor and spice and added a lot to the meal as well. The atmosphere and the service were excellent. We recommend coming here for a nice patio experience if you're around the area looking to get a late night drink, uh, appetizers, or even just some quick bites. And that's it for today's video. Thanks for watching. Please like and subscribe to our channel and we'll see you in the next one.